You guys, today we're back. We gotta get the golf cart ready for the Redneck Rumble. That's next week. But, we have an issue. Yeah. I don't have a spot to put a cooler like this right here. So, what I'm gonna do, I went to Harbor Freight. I grabbed this roof-mounted cargo carrier and it is about three feet by 48 and it seems like it's going to fit on top so that's the project today that's what we're getting into all right guys so i have to put these pieces to Oops. all right we got the front i think they just slide in like so. Alright. There's the front of it. I'm going to put on this so I don't scratch it yet. rack. Now we're going to try to put it on, see if it fits. But it's pretty cool. It's got the, I got a logo right there, a hooligan logo put on there. So I took the sticker off already. So first up, we're just doing some test fitting, but uh, this looks like it's going to fit. Fits perfect actually. Almost like it was meant for a golf cart. So, let's see how I gotta go about doing the screws, the mine brackets. I think I'm gonna mount them all the way through and then screw them to the back side. But, uh, what do you guys think so far? I think this is gonna look sharp. And then put a logo up there, maybe Tour and Explorer also. But, yep, that's it, guys. I'm gonna get into mounting, see how the easiest way is to mount this. All right, you guys, this is what I got. You got to put the blocks on before. And make sure to put these spacers right here. They cover up the screws. I got to go back through and put them on over here. But next step is we're going to move these brackets right there. So I'll show you what I did right here. Now I'm going to drill two holes through it, through to the other side, make sure nothing's over there. I'm going to do that on all four of them. And we'll be back. Alright guys, I got my drill bit. I lined it up. I'm going to go with a 5 16 so it matches the bracket right here. I'm going to make some holes and I'll be back to you. Alright guys, so I got this one mounted right here, I did, and then the bracket underneath, I got the holes drilled for this one, and then the holes up top, so I'll put this bracket through the bottom, feed it up, and then I'm going to attach the mounting things, and we should be all set right here guys. Alright, so just like that, put the bracket on, and screw these things on, and we're mounted on the left hand side. I wanted to do the left first so it didn't move from side to side, but that's it guys. I'm going to get into this, I'm going to do the rest of it, and then we'll see how it looks, but looking pretty good so far. Alright guys, what do you think? I like it. Still got to clean it up, put some stickers on here, get some goo gone, stuff like that. But it's going to look sharp and I can put cooler on top. And just like that, cooler mount or whatever I want, backpacks, that type of stuff for events or if I buy some stuff. 
All right, guys, that's it for the golf cart build this time. I got the rack. I'm headed to Redneck Rumble pretty soon. Hope we'll see some of you guys there. Look out for the cart. It's going to be the only one with a Tour and Explorer and the tent window. We'll see you guys next time. Make sure you subscribe if you like this type of stuff. We are doing a lot of stuff on our rebuilt golf cart. We got this thing. It didn't even run. Now it's running good and looking sharp. Stay tuned for the next one, guys.